it's not coming naturally, you might not be with the right person. Because my finger was bleeding out. I miss you, my flower. A, a giant, big, white, <laughs> bald dude walks into my apartment. Wait! We're back. We're back. What's poppin'? What's poppin'? And welcome back to the channel. If you're new, make sure you hit that subscribe button and throw us a like if you like what you see what we're doing today, babe. That was crazy. That was crazy. That was crazy. Bro, that I was, was just going to say it. I wasn't going to say it and I didn't feel like I needed shit. That was a little bit crazy, baby. We are doing a dinner party tonight, which I don't know if party is the right word, but I also don't know what else to call it. <laughs> it's not It's not the right word. My mom was like, you have a party tonight? I'm like, no, we literally have two friends going yeah, over. So our, our um <laughs> friends, our married couple friends are, what the fuck? How the fuck do I say that? Our, we, our friends are a married couple. And they're coming to our house for dinner, and we're cooking for them. But the the wife in the the relationship is very is like a really good cook. So now yeah. I'm trying to get good shit. So that like no like so her name is Taylor, and she be cooking like cooking cooking. She be cooking like, she every, cook day. every day. Like she cooks every day for Dean, and, and she cook like and what am I gonna cook for <laughs> Dean and Taylor that they never had before? Nothing. So. so like they invited us over last year. We went to their house, and they cooked dinner for us, and it was so good. It was like some type of crab that like melted in your mouth, but it was like like a pasta. It had taste, a name. I don't like remember tomatoes. what the name was. So yeah, it was like a fancy name because they're very fancy. So we don't know what to make because we're not fancy at all. We eat the same thing all the time. <laughs> Victoria's like, should we make a mac and cheese and whatever? I'm like, no, bro. Let's go get something good. What are we making? Steak with chimichurri, <laughs> roasted potatoes, and asparagus so we're at target right now y'all know we never come to target for food but we have gift cards so we're gonna try to we got use these gift 70 dollars worth of target gift cards for christmas actually i think 60 right 60 yeah 50 and 10 oh this is only 10 who will give us 10 dollars? no because when you buy a certain amount in there you get a 10 dollar gift card so i just put it in your thing. oh i was like why would they give us 10 dollars? that is rude um, okay so we got 60 dollars. so that's the only reason why we're doing grocery shopping at target because we're trying to be frugal and not spend our own money we're gonna take y'all along as we prepare for our um little hangout tonight dinner party dinner party Something just got in my shoes. Okay, grocery list. Let's go. I don't even know where the groceries are in here. Oh, they might not have none. Oh, wait. This you is know, a, some stuff. This isn't a super Target. That's fine. Is this worth it? To spend our Target gift yeah. card here on that? Yeah, probably not. So should we just buy this stuff and then save the Target gift card for another day? Or should we just spend it? Because we're going to spend it anyway. Yeah, let's just spend it because, yeah, we're going to spend it anyway. But, but not on groceries. I don't know. What do y'all think? I don't know. Hmm. Oh, I wish they just had everything. All right, y'all. We uh, we didn't check out at Target, um, but now we have Publix, so it's really the same thing. Let's get to the bread. Let's get to the bread to the cheddar. All right. All right. We need brush bruschetta. Look, bruschetta. Bow. That's exactly what we got at home. No, we don't make ours. That don't even look like it. It look, it look like you're drowning. Ours gonna be fresh. Yeah, Fresher. it does. It does. It does. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. Parmesan cheese. A block. We trying to cook like chefs tonight. All right, y'all. We made it back home. We got all of our ingredients for a meal. Babe's cleaning up. Yes, sir. I'm gonna start prepping. Oh, and she lighting candles. Uh, bruschetta. Bruschetta. So I'm chopping the um, tomatoes. She's going to do the butter or butter, oil with garlic. Yeah, like butter, like seasoned oil to put for the, the bruschetta. Bruschetta. You're crazy. I like it. Ooh, I sharpened my knife. Is it working like nice? Mm -hmm. Slide it right through. Be careful. Every time I see you with the knife, I think by that time that uh, you almost cut your finger off. Very traumatic time for the both of us. I was on my way to get a haircut back when we lived in our apartment. 
and I was like a block away from the barber, and Lindsay called me like you were like you're like okay, don't panic. No, but no, 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 no. What? How are you? How I said okay, don't panic. It, it was like it was like okay, because, but it no. was like it was still this like urgency in the voice. Yeah, because my finger was bleeding out. <laughs> but the thing about the thing about Victoria is like. In those situations, I love you, baby, but you don't be helping sometimes. Like, you help. You come, like, I panic. I have bad anxiety. Yeah, actually. she panics. Like, what? Like, I'll be like, the other day, I literally was, like, on the couch watching TV, and I was like, oh, my God. Like, literally just like that. I think I saw something on my phone. And she no, goes, no, no. It, it was a little bit more dramatic. Baby, it was a little bit more dramatic. No. It was a little bit more dramatic than that. You said, oh, my God. <laughs> okay, whatever. I'll give that to you. She comes out of the, the bathroom. What? What? <laughs> I was like, what? I was like, what? No, Whoa. She said, I thought somebody was in the house. <laughs> what? I was so scared. It's like, I do not, I cannot explain it. When I heard her say, oh my God, my mind, the paranoia, I immediately said somebody's in our house. And I ran out of the bathroom. Baby, like, I promise you, somebody was, if somebody was in our house, I would be saying a lot more than all my. It's like you don't even know what she was saying. Yeah, honestly. You know? Well, somebody did come in my house. Fun fact. You oh, know. Yeah. Before we met, before we were dating. Yeah, before we were dating. I was in one of my apartments in Atlanta. Me and my friend were just sitting on the couch watching TV. And a man walks, a, a giant, big, white, <laughs> bald dude walks into my apartment. Meanwhile, like, we're, like, sitting on the couch chilling, like, laughing. We were watching some stupid shit. Literally cracking up in the middle of just laughing. And, and then this guy walks in the apartment, and I'm like, wait, who are you? Like, it took me, like, five seconds to just, like, process the situation. And I was like, who are you? And he was like, this is my house. And I was like, no, it's not. Get out. Get yeah. out. Meanwhile, Bryce is just like trying to jump on him and uh, lick him. Yeah, like greet him at the door. He was like, act like he was going to go out. And then he slammed the door shut. And I was like, oh, this is it. This is my time. <laughs> Turns out it was my landlord who I'd never met before. I just like texted him, you know, to pay him or whatever. But I think he was going through some things and he was a little drunk in the middle of the day and so he wasn't wrong it was his house but <laughs> i didn't find out who it was until a day or two later after like trying to fucking figure out what just happened it's like not a, a brush like a that's not the brush i thought it was <laughs> it's like fucking soaking it in it's not spreading it. that's so what there saying. it is this is what i was looking for <laughs> Uh, one third of a cup. You have a third of a cup? Yeah, yeah I'll hand you a cup. And then here's, I'm gonna leave the directions between us. Thanks. I got you, my love. I got you, my love, my love, my precious, my princess. Thank you, my baby. Darling. Um, what were you saying before I cut you off? I'm so sorry. You're fine. You didn't cut me off. Did you finish what you were saying though? I thought, I felt like I cut you off to ask about the brush. Oh, <laughs> I don't remember, but it's fine. You getting some of that garlic on there? Well, now I am because I got the right brush. Oh, okay. That other brush was not moving, it was stiff. Now that I have the right brush, things are about to really get rolling over here. Fun fact, before <laughs> dating Lindsay, I could not call somebody a pet name without gagging and throwing it in my mouth. Oh. Like, I could not say the word baby. My ex, I tried so hard, y'all. I would try to force it. I would be like, babe. Babe, it didn't even sound right. Can you name a few of the things that I've said to you that were like endearing or baby names, pet names? She calls me darling, sweetheart. One of my story is, if it's not coming naturally, you might not be with the right person. We say endearing things all the time. You say things like, what did you say to me the other day? You said, I miss you. It was like, flower. yeah, flower. I like flower. And then she'll be like, ooh, I like that one. I like flower. You said, I miss you, my flower. <laughs> the whole meal from scratch. Who are we? We're always in the kitchen. We are. I was literally thinking about that. Like, Y'all sick of us being in the kitchen? I mean, what else are we supposed to do? All we do is eat. You gotta eat. <laughs> Good luck. Eat and then watch TV, but like, y'all are gonna watch us watch TV. One of our blogs that we posted recently, someone said, 
Oh, y'all really in love, love, because y'all kissing with booty. I saw that comment. <laughs> I didn't even, I never even think about that. Do you? What did we do? We kissed with booty in our mouth? I mean, we were eating breakfast. Oh. We both had food in our mouth, and we leaned over, and we kissed. Yeah, I mean, like, it's not like I have food. It's not like we were making out. I yeah, guess. it's like, you know, you just feel the softness of the lips. But maybe that's the key, being in love, love for a lot of things. I mean, we kiss right in the morning. But again, we're not making out. And we're not like making out with more in breath. We're not crazy. We're not that in love. <laughs> <laughs> That's where we draw a line. That's where we draw the line. <laughs> ready because those will be on by the time they arrive the asparagus is finished the potatoes are in the oven and i'm gonna show y'all our little table set up and then we're gonna wrap this up and get this going this is our little table set up got some candles some fresh flowers that i got Lindsay this week and yeah we are gonna put the spread along this table and it's gonna be so nice Bam, bam, bam. Okay. Bam, bam, bam. You got this, baby. That'd be fire. Can you open that? I can do whatever you need me to do. What is it? The door. Oh, I think it's open. Oh, is it? Oh. Just open. All right. First thing's out here. I'm going to turn the um, lights on for you out here. You don't even have to be in the dark. Thank you. And there was a spoon, a black spoon. Black spoon? Yeah, like the, the big one? Yeah. Okay, let's turn on the lights for that crazy girl. I got the nice, uh, uh, thank you. what's it called? Thermometer? Meat thermometer or whatever. Thank you. And the spoon that you were asking about. Yes, ma'am. Oops, sorry. This is the main course of the night. Can't screw this up, no pressure. <laughs> <laughs> this is it. You're doing really good. Thanks. I gotta flip it. Um, Let's go. Flip it. Flip it. Flip it. Flip it. I need tongs. Tongs? Do you have any? No. Okay. okay. Oh, wait. I think I'm going to be grabbing tongs. All right. I got you. All right. I got two more really important items for the cook, the chef, the Very grill master, mm -hmm. a beer, some tongs. It reminds me of summer again. <laughs> You know it's freezing out here. We're kind of hot because we just had a hot shower. Ooh, holy shit. What? Thanks oh my god, that's so huge. <laughs> oh, it's you should have cut it. <laughs> you should have like cut like half and half. <laughs> no. Why didn't you cut it? Oh, that's okay. 
I think it'll still be fire. I think so too. Okay, baby. We just had a very successful dinner party and we are a little bit tipsy, but it was so fun and it worked out so well. And I know you were so stressed about your steak, but look how good it turned out. And they, and they cleaned their plates, which is like the best sign for a dinner party. I know. It was fun, it was an amazing time. So we're gonna clean up, but thanks for helping us prep for our dinner party, it was so fun. Love you guys, anything else maybe? Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you when we see you. And as always, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, period. Bye.